mindful of the negative impact on the environment of gas and fumes emitted from cars as a result of their fuel like fossil, gaseous and liquid and the urge to reduce the risk of contracting incommunicable and respiratory diseases like lung cancer, asthma, etc. caused by the inhaling of hazardous fumes emitted by normal cars. Emmanuel has been spending sleepless nights in the past three years in trying to figure out a solution to this. This has driven him to make what he describes as an imagination car just from using scrap metals and other electrical equipment he bought from the local markets. Emmanuel has just created Sierra Leone's first locally made solar powered car that is eco-friendly and does not use or need to use any form of fuel to power it. From child age, from primary school, I love cre and creativity, I love making um, things out of scratch. When I was a child, I, I used to find this um, this thing cup. We say in our local, in our local diets, we call it milk cup. I used to, 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 to collect them from the dustbin, and you know I used my own knowledge to make a um, vehicle out of this thing cup. And also again, I, I, I when I was a child, um, I usually build this um, I would say battery generator. You know, collect battery from the dustbin, pull them together. You know, find the, the positive and the negative and find a light and connect it and doing that process you know there, there is some electricity and during the night we use that's the, uh, this type of technologies to study so i would say from child age is where i got this inspiration and up to now the inspiration is within me the body of the car is built with bamboo which is a local material carved from palm tree straws. This car can cover an approximated distance of 15 km per hour on a charred road. The Imagination Solar Car has a long solar panel at the top of it which powers the engine and also acts as its canopy. The car has a self-made engine which is different from other cars with three gears attached to it for both front and back movements. It has a left and right traffic lights, a horn, four headlights and an accurate brake system. It has two doors and two mirrors attached to its left and right flanks to view objects from the back. Most of the car we are using in Sierra Leone have been powered by four side fuel. Uh, example the kerosene, the diesel, the petrol, and the rest. This this um, fossil fuel and um, vehicle emits poisonous gas into the atmosphere, and this poisonous gas mixed with the oxygen that we, we inhale cause um, cancer, lung disease in our system, and also not only uh, um, it affect the lives of human beings, but also disturb the climate system, cause global warming, climate change. You know. This, uh, this are, these are some of the challenges that I, that I saw that inspire me to create this imagination car that do not use any fossil fuel and it is free of air and noise pollution. So it makes the environment very eco-friendly for us and also again, it also helps the United, Sustain, um, United Sustainable Development Goal which is Goal 7 which talk about clean and affordable energy. So this imagination car we, 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 we also help the, the UN to achieve um, goal 7 of the Sustainable Development Goal to reach the year 2030. But how far does Emmanuel want to go with technology and what are immediate plans or ideas on technology? Imagination car is not the end. I have more than 50 solutions that can help the environment. Innovation like you know solving energy, uh, electricity, solving health issue, solving water issue, so they are coming. I would say in the next five years or three years, Seattle will be at the top of the map because Seattle is a small country. We have a lot of talented people. We have a lot of devoted young, young minds. But with the help of our, our, our perseverance, the help of our hard work, Seattle will be at the top of the map and it creates positive impacts national and internationally. Goal 7 of the Sustainable Development Goals talks about clean energy and having a solar car like the Imagination Car using only solar power for transportation which makes for a cleaner atmosphere. It reduces the risk of dangerous gaseous emissions.